Bye again, guys. I was going to go take the drawer out, but I didn't expect it to, to be like this. It's been like proper throwing it down for the past two hours now. So, I don't think I'm going anywhere just to stay in the house. So, I've got to work in about four hours' time. So, first things first. I need some food and I'm going to tidy up as well a little bit so I think what today I'll just insist on is probably sorting out the stuff when I move out and tidy it up I uh, just want to mention guys living on your own or oh, what I do is a lot harder than I think just have to run around clean the floors Enter the dishwasher, do that, and then finally I'm gonna get around to actually get some food. I've been trying to do that in between doing that. It's <sighs> a lot. But yeah, I'm gonna have cheese toasters. They're a little bit crisp because of stuff being sat in there, which I should turn off. But yeah. So I'm gonna put all the washing out because it's still raining, so I have to put it all up in here. Tidy up floors, do this, do that, so. It's a lot, a lot of work. But on the upside, I have uh, found some pen. Oh, finally able to sit down after an hour of being up and just tidying everything. Yeah, finally gonna enjoy my cheese toast. I don't know why I'm talking like that. Finally enjoy my cheese toast. Alright guys, what still hasn't stopped raining. Oh, oh literally all day. And I've got to set off in about two hours time, something like that. Oh, too hard. Just look how beautiful it is. It's constantly raining, just non stop. Hopefully, and I have checked, it's supposed to stop for about 10 o'clock tomorrow. So I thought it does stop. By the time uh, I'm up and uh, out tomorrow, because my back does feel a lot better, so 50 50 bats again. Hey right, guys, well after a boring day to sat in the house and finally have to work and I kind of just didn't want to leave. It's for how bad the weather is. I've got a still wear big jacket in the piss of rain. It's just horrible. So I really don't want to know what works like when it's been raining all day. But I've literally got right just today's shift, I've got like four or five hours and I'm off tomorrow. And like I mentioned, it's supposed to I can't even see outside of the hood. Uh, it's supposed to brighten up, so hopefully I'll, uh, I'll get to skate tomorrow. Well, fingers crossed I'll get to skate tomorrow. Because I said it's supposed to start, like I said, about 10 11 ish, so we'll see. But I'm glad I went off today because today would have just been such a boring day. Just sat in all day, not doing anything. Well, I finally probably found a way to attempt the then, but I'm kind of glad I've got to go to work because at least it's something to do. At least I can get out of the house. But yeah, alright. Now I've been there, get to the tram stop and get out the way. So I'm gonna get to the tram stop, get out the way. So I'll see you guys when we get like close to work. Oh, near enough at work. <laughs> Not so written, but on the upside, both trams all the way here are dead. So, fingers crossed, touch wood if I can find some. Here I can hit it. it might be a quiet night, but I think I've just said that and jinxed it, but it could be because like, if it's like really, really bad rain, no one really comes out. Oh, no, sorry. So, we'll see, but I will. Uh, See you guys in the first time because I'm just going to hurry up and get out of this because it is getting worse. There's a guy there, his name, just in a hood. He's a bit, a bit crazy to be honest. <laughs> I don't want to be out in this in just a hood. I think it's so through in this car. But yeah, like I said, see you guys in four or five hours time. And uh, I'm going to see how busy it is. Alright guys, finally finished what has been not a bad night. Like, bearing in mind the weather, and bearing in mind it is still raining, so it's not been too bad. We literally finished at 10, and 
didn't really expect to finish this. I would say it's kind of late but kind of early as well. I didn't expect to finish it this time, so I didn't do too bad. But I'm going to hurry up and run to the tram because normally I would wait and get some food and stuff, but I just want to get home and uh, try and make the shop on my own because I'm going to grab some, uh, some, uh, some, I don't know, like that. The sandwich is up from there, so hopefully I can make it if I make this tram. But my headache has gone away because you know those like tablets you can get with like the plastic coating? You're not supposed to like bite into them because they're supposed to like dissolve in your stomach. I did and it was the worst thing I've ever done. It tastes so horrible, I don't even have throw up. But I kind of think that's got rid of my headache a little bit. Like I accidentally bite into it. So I'm kind of lucky. But I ain't staying dry even though I'm trying to stay under the trees. Which is not working. But just gonna hurry up and get myself on the tram and get myself to the shop. So I will talk to you guys very shortly. Hey guys, we're finally got some food and this time I remembered. And, uh, sorry. I can taste that tablet from Ellen. And the tram is due in four minutes. So I'm gonna open go, then to go on and try and take root of that as well if you'll go out in the rain. Alright guys, we're finally off the tram and it's coming down proper everywhere than it is what it was in town. I am getting absolutely soaked. This is horrible. I was going to take Rupert out but I've just had a, well I've just run my brother. He says it took him out about an hour ago and it didn't go anywhere. So the likelihood of him going any further now is not going to happen at all because this is just, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even want to be out in this myself and I already am. So, I'm gonna open, get in, get dry and get the vlog up. Oh god, the puddles are getting worse. So, oh, I've just done one, it's me butt wet. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow as always. Night guys, bye.